what is up i know i'm already a mess my hair is all crazy i've already been working please excuse the difference i know that it may look different i'm playing with the settings usually I have it on hdr i had a couple other different settings so let me know how that looks let's get into this so what i got going on i jumped in without you guys because it's just a lot kind of overwhelming actually got a lot done actually not as bad as i thought it was going to be so pretty much for the most part everything is hooked up that needs to be hooked up i got to cover the alternator that's getting power there is that extra connector that i told you guys about um, for the alternator and that's just because like i said instead of it being on the wire harness that's on the engine our engine harness it's on the chassis harness so there's two now so hopefully that works out just fine. I think it will because I have the 92 ECU hooked up to it. Everything on this side is pretty much hooked up. There's one loose one from the old power steering module that we don't use anymore. It's been loose, been like that on the last car as well. This is a horn one. The reason that that is loose because it has different horns from the 92 to the 95. I have the 92 horn somewhere here, but not really worried about it. That'll go in when it goes in. Everything else is hooked up except there's one last thing that isn't which is the starter and it is hooked up but it's not hooked up to this one this is the one with the piece connected to the terminal and the relay box which we need it to run everything the other one that is connected to the starter is not connected to that and doesn't have that connector so we do actually have an extra wire right here which is this one that's connected to the starter and then this is the one that's going to go to the starter that needs to go to the starter other than that, everything is connected. This is my negative post. And then here is my positive post. So now I have to figure out what's going on with this. I have to take that off, put that other piece on. Radar's gotta go in. Radiator has to go in. Intake, drive shaft is over there, has to be put in. So now it's just kind of putting stuff in little by little. Wire harness is going into the engine, I mean, to the cabin. I'm almost done with that. I have to connect the heater core valve. So it's just tying up all the loose ends. I'm gonna start doing the radiator. I'll time-lapse that for y'all. And then I think we're gonna go into the car and start doing the door cards, which is kind of exciting to get that done, get that out of the way, get these doors out of the way. And yeah, we're getting close to a startup. Okay, so just losses left and right. I took apart the shock because I was going to do the front to do the coilovers. These things are C's beyond, I don't think, repair. I'm going to try to save this one. I'm going to start with that one because I'm going to be working through the weekend. So I'm going to try with that one over the weekend at my house because I'm not going to be here. And then we'll get back to that. If not, I'll buy new ones. They're not that expensive. I don't really care. We'll send it. This, you guys seen the time last for this. So now the engine bay is pretty much complete. There's a few things that I got to tie up. I have to do the starter wire because the starter wire is attached to the battery piece so that it can get power. But this one is not attached to the starter right now. I got the old one in there. Still got to do the throttle cable. Got to feed this harness back through into the cabin. All of this on this side is good, except for the alternator. I got to cover the alternator bolt so that's not exposed. Power steering is in, AC is in. I do have to get a new one for this because I can't find my old belt and I'm not really worried about that. It's, it's good, I'll order a bigger one so that it stresses the power steering out less. I can't remember, there was something else here that I had forgotten that wasn't working, but I think it was just those few things, which it wasn't, that wasn't that crazy of an out. Everything is in on here. This all went in pretty easily. This wasn't too bad. Now, 
We're on the doors. I thought the doors were going to be a lot easier. Was I wrong? So everything's off of the actual thing, the door card. This is one door. We're trying to get the glass out right now so I can get the regulator out because that regulator doesn't work in that car. <sighs> we got to take this whole door apart just to get the glass out because that regulator won't come out without the glass out of the door. So dealing with that and I was going to continue. I do have more time tonight, but I am just I'm tired of the losses today. I'm, I'm not into it. So I'm going to finish that door I'm gonna put everything away and pretty much going to call it a night think that is it i mean you guys are gonna have to wait till next week unfortunately it is what it is later hope y'all enjoyed take it easy